everything always starts with an idea, so everything's always a concept rather than maybe a song or a melody or a lyric or a rhythm. This always starts with an idea. And then we think how is the best way to express this idea. In this project here in Taiwan, working with space, it was the idea how do you express space and it was two things. For me, it's the things when you look at the stars and it's the space in between the stars. And to me, that was the clue, really. Can these stars as physical objects in the sky express a note or a texture? So at the beginning, we assigned a note or a texture or a, a very small melody to each star. And then with these star boxes, which we've uh, designed and developed, gives us the ability to play the stars. What's interesting for me is that these uh, pieces of work, they're never, ever finished. They're always fluid, they're always moving. And they're trying to find that balance between intent, between when you intervene and when it's necessary to let go and let the universe or chaos unfold. And that's the exciting thing. Rather than going in with something which is preformed and pre-thought in our head, it's actually responding to either the sounds that the star makes or responding to the sounds of the bees. So it's trying to find the harmony between these two things. This has been an amazing collaboration. And we looked at and listened to quite a few really talented, amazing Taiwanese musicians. And we started composing some pieces of melody, music, textures, and then we sent some of these textures and little samples over to Fu Ray to listen to, to maybe just get an idea of maybe the atmosphere we were going in. But we were really keen that we didn't do too much, we didn't write a, a piece of work, that the collaboration would be improvised, it would be resolved within the performance. I think you get a feeling and a sense that there's a lot of people listening, there's a kind of a collective amount of people all around you and all your senses become heightened. You realise that what you're doing, it's in the now, it's in the moment and the slightest little thing you'll hit or strum or blow has a real impact. And we loved it, we, we thought it was really special. I'm really glad that it happened. It's been an amazing experience.